Welcome to TSS Associates Troubleshooting Guide for the Bosch Inverter Heat Pumps. Today, we'll show you how to diagnose and fix transducer issues with your Bosch heat pump. Let's get started. To test the transducer, you will need to locate where it plugs into the control board. This terminal on the right side of the board is labeled CN16 and has black, white, and red wires in a white plug. The error code that will be displayed on the LED will be an H8. To troubleshoot this error code, you will need a multimeter with needle probes and your refrigeration gauges. To test, using your needle points, first measure across the red and black wires in DC voltage. Make sure you have between 4.5 and 5 volts DC. If the value does not fall between 4.5 and 5 volts DC, then your control board is faulty. Next, read across the white and black wires to get your operational value. You can check the transducer in either heating or cooling. Heating will be tested on the high side and the cooling will be tested on the low side. Now, connect your gauges to the suction and liquid line ports. In cooling, write down your suction line pressure or in heating, write down your liquid line pressure. Convert your pressure to DC voltage using the chart shown. For example, if you read 290 PSI, your output voltage should be 2.7 volts DC. Does your pressure correlate with your output voltage? If these values do not correlate, then you have a faulty transducer. Another way to check the transducer if the values fall within the parameters, you can use checkpoint 9 and 10 on the control board. If parameter 10 is 580 PSI or if parameter 9 is 14 PSI, the transducer is faulty. Thank you for watching. We hope you found this training video helpful and informative. If you have any questions or need further assistance, please don't hesitate to reach out. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more valuable content. Have a great day.